favorite Proverbs? No? Okay. I, I guess I'm a proverb nerd. I love Proverbs. Any quotes by people you love? No? Hey, Brady, you got Proverbs back there. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, I got my bad blood is thicker than water. Blood is thicker than water, yes. Um, I think my favorite one is the hungriest line is the one at the top, or the strongest line is the one at the front of the herd, the one just the one trying to make it to the top. Mm, yes. Who else? I think I'm going to be the change you want to see. Be the change you want to see, yes. Laugh now, die later. Mm. <laughs> Laugh now, die later. Okay, good, good, yeah. So when the money goes, will the honey stay? <laughs> <laughs> thank you, thank you, Dr. <laughs> so you have to take the proverb, um, be the change you want to see, and then you have to create a speech. But the speech would have an introduction, a premise statement, points one, two, and three, and conclusion, and at each point you have to cite sources to support your point. In five to seven minutes, off the top of the dome, with the proverb or quote on an index card. And you have to come up and give a speech. Basically, it's an oral essay. You know, and you have to make it up. So, extemporaneous, you had to take a current event and make up a speech about that. And so I ended up getting into these rounds, and I decided I didn't want to embarrass myself my school or my gender. And so I went and I just said, I was just gonna do whatever I do if I made a fool out of myself. And we came out and they posted finals at the end of the day and guess what happened? I made finals. But then I made it, but then guess what that meant? I had to do it again. And I ended up placing third and fifth and at the end of that day, on the ride home back to our school, I thought, like, what was it that I was so afraid of? <laughs> I had all of these awards in poetry and performance. Why would I be so afraid to get up in front of an audience? And that's when I started to understand false confidence. You guys know what I mean by false confidence? Those people who walk around and you think that they are so fly and you think that they would know that, but not really, they don't inside. Mm -hmm. And then my theory was, imagine if I took this experience and gave that to MCs mm. and to rappers. Because a lot of times the violence that happens in hip hop and popular music happens because people are scared, right? Some of the language that happens happens because people are scared. And if you empower people, fear goes away, they become more creative. And you don't even have to preach to them, it's just through the process, and that's what Freestyle Union was about. The ground rules for Freestyle Union are, the bitch hoe shit is not a discussion. We don't debate whether or not it's valid to call women bitches and hoes. Why? Because if your mother walks in that door, and I say, who's that bitch right there, you'd be offended. And I believe there are enough contradictions in the world, and that's one that I choose not to have in this cycle. So we have that as a ground rule, right? That ground rule didn't come easy. It came because some older poets came and there were a group of teenage girls off to the side there to see the boys. And the older poet said to me, you need to be more of a leader. And you need to stop that. And I said, what? They're, everybody's going to leave. And they coached me on how to say it and I went and I said, the bitch old thing, we're not doing that anymore. And no one left. Hmm. And I said, okay, well if it was that easy, the next week I had a new ground rule, no battling in the cycle. You know why I say no battling? Because battling changes the focus. Once you have a clear competitor and I'm competing against her, I'm no longer focused on me. And what I wanted to create was an environment where people could come to practice self-development. Mm. Self-development. That means focusing on self. You use the cipher as a place to master your form to master your technique. That's what self-development is about. It's not about focusing on those outside of you. And also, if you have a weaker opponent and you're consistently beating weaker opponents, who's to say that you're really that great? It's like if the Lakers beat the Wizards, no this. but if the Lakers beat the Wizards, who's really talking about that? 
right? But when the Lakers beat the Celtics, we have a little conversation now. The Bulls. Okay, here she goes. Yeah. <laughs> we're, having a, we're having a conversation now, and that's the distinction. And that's and then the other problem was no written rhymes. Why? Because once you learn how to think on your feet, once you have mastered the ability to think on your feet, there's very little that you can you cannot do. Once that fear is gone, you have so much more mastery over your life and your destiny, your emotions, how you communicate, how you interact with others, how you deal with challenges and obstacles. And it seems like this one little simple thing, oh, you're just talking about freestyling. No, it's so much bigger than that. And that's why the arts are so important. And that's why it's unfortunate and sad that the arts are being cut all over our country. It's very, very sad, because that's what the arts offers us in terms of human development. It's not about artistic development, but that's a, a soapbox I won't get on today. All right, for freestyle you. So I say all of that to say, freestyling is very important. I am an advocate of improvisation. I also run workshops around improvisational spoken word, and that's what I like for us to do now. Who's down? Maybe one person from each section. <laughs> Or maybe even genders. Or maybe we have a bunch of girls. Drew, we got Drew. Who's got Who's got a Someone from my class has got to step up. There's a lot of them here, and they wouldn't want to embarrass me by not doing that. Right? Why? Want to be with one person from over here? So you guys choose someone. Choose someone. Choose someone. Choose someone. Choose someone. in the last 24 hours who have emailed me to get into one of my classes. If you join the cipher, I'll sign you up immediately. Oh. Black man, let's go. Right. Y'all ready that? All right. Okay. Yes, <laughs> we need one more girl. We need one more girl. All right. Just call on the Holy Spirit. <laughs> okay, so what we need now is a topic from you all. <laughs> education class change. Okay, education class, we're gonna use that one next. Unity. Education class and change, right? Yes, we do. Well, okay, one. Okay. He's right. I'm pushing. I'm pushing. Okay. I want to point out that the uh, 13 to 17 year old set was able to do three or four this morning, right? Ooh. Yeah. No, that's big warm up. And there was a 10 year old in there. <laughs> that was a 10 year old. Okay, so education is the topic, right? So what they're going to do is they're going to improvise, freestyle a poem for us. They're going to show you how we all have access to language, to poetry, and it's right here. We all have a knowledge bank. You just gotta know how to cash it, right? Get the currency up, right? So, what you're gonna do is you're just gonna go one, two, three, four, five. Uh, uh, you wanna hear me start? You want Larry to start? I have to do it anyway. Larry, stop looking at me like that, Larry. One, two, three, four. Okay, good. So we'll, we'll do a few rounds. And remember, you have to end it, so end it strong. Now, if you get stuck, there's some ground rules. You can't say, I don't know. You can't say, I can't. You can't say, I don't do this. 
Can't say it. Can't say it. Can you do this? Can't. Any of that is outlawed. What you can say is education. Or you can make a statement about education, all right? You can play with rhythm amongst yourselves. You can bite off of the way someone else starts it. So if someone starts in a certain way, like I know, you can say I know. Nick first says I know. And then, you know, play, but listen to each other and feed off of each other. I want you to paint word pictures, right? Paint word pictures. So I want everybody to kind of participate with them and say, this feels good. This feels good. Say, you guys are good. You guys are good. <laughs> 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 